We're going to get the minutes out of the last Bank of Japan meeting. Yeah, um, at which they didn't do very much. Um, so that'll be interesting given that we now have this currency dynamic to, to kind of focus on here. The Bank of Japan, of course, not the one intervening in currency markets. Yeah. It'd be the Ministry of Finance. But you can expect yeah. a lot of attention on interest rate differentials and what kind of outlook uh, you can divine from those minutes. And then we go over to the U.K. Expected to get local elections there. Alex, who you got? I don't know. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> uh, keep an eye on that, though. Of course, uh, those local elections sometimes do have national ramifications. We joke. Uh, Labor but of course, Party. What but of does course, Labor Party anything do? major happens, we will bring it to you. We also get a lot of economic data uh, tomorrow as well, jobless claims, trade data, and factory orders. What matters most? I'm looking at earnings. Uh, you mentioned Nova Nordisk. We also get Shell, Apple. Obviously, we're, we're watching Moderna, Coinbase, and U.S. Steel. Uh, I think Shell's going to be quite interesting. Can they maintain the buyback pace, which has been pretty juicy, particularly when you have the big guys like Exxon and Chevron also delivering some super solid buybacks as I'm well? A, I'm, I'm going to keep an eye on Coinbase. I'm kind of curious, okay. given the big run-up that we've seen in Bitcoin uh, and uh, whether, uh, you know, remember there was so much talk how a Bitcoin ETF would kill Coinbase, right? Mm -hmm. Why go through Coinbase and that? But they've done well.